Hi guys, in this example we will learn how to call Ajax request in Laravel application. So in this example I will create simple form and call Ajax request to store post record into the database. So let's get started with the example. So you can see that I already downloaded fresh Laravel application and configured database as well. So you can see that. Now let me create a post table first. Okay, so let me create a migration. So I will say PHP artisan Mac migration and i will say create underscore post table okay and now you can see here it's created a post table so let me go and add two columns over here so i will say string and title and there will be a body column and with the text data type okay so simply go and run the migration okay php artisan migrate okay so you can see that created a post table over here you can see that okay with the title and body okay now let me create a model for it so i will say php artisan mac model and i will say post okay and now if i go here you can see that into the model folder you can see that post let me define the column name over here so i will say protected fillable i will give the title and then i will say body column okay and simply save it okay now let me create one controller and create a route so we will create a form for it so i will say php artisan mac controller and i will say post controller okay and it's created a one controller now let me create one route over here so let me go and create one route and i will say simply post and i will call post controller colon colon class and then i will say index and simply save it and now let me use the namespace so i will use the post controller namespace and now if i go to the controller i will create an index method so simply i will go okay and here simply i will return view and post okay and simply save it okay now let me go into the resource into the view folder i will create post plaid file so post dot bled dot php okay and i'm going to use the bootstrap so let me use the bootstrap cdn and with the proper design so i will say laravel ajax request example okay and into the body i will create a one form so i'm going to create bootstrap form over here so simply form with the you can see that i'm adding the title column title input so here will be the title and i also give the id id will be the title and simply copy and now what i will do i will simply add the body okay in body for the for the body i will use text area okay and i will give the name body and class will be the form control and also i will give the id id will be the body simply save it and also for the form i will also give the id so we can use for the ajax request so i will say create post okay simply say when now what we will do when click on the submit button it should handle by the ajax request so first we need to use the jquery so i'm going to do quickly jquery cdn so i will copy it and simply paste it over here okay simply save it and now what i will do i will simply write script for it and here i will be do doing like a create post dot submit when it submit it will call the function and there will be a pass the argument e and i will say like prevent default so it will just pause not submit the form directly and then i will get the title value so i will say title and title id dot well okay and then i will get the body and then i will say simply body id and then i will say simply well function okay and i will also because we need to require token for the post request so i will also take the token and we already added the csrf token so i will give the name underscore token and at the end i will use the well function and simply save it and now here i will write the ajax request dot jax and i will say simply 
first i will pass the type and type will be the post request okay and then we need to pass the url that i will create and add over here and the next will be the data so i will simply pass the ajax data so i will simply call underscore token and variable will be underscore token and then i will say simply title and i will pass the title variable and over here i will pass the body parameter body and then body variable and next there will be a success message okay and i will when ajax request will be success then it will be giving the response on this function so i will simply response and i will simply uh, console log that one so console dot log and i will say response okay simply save it okay if anything goes wrong then that call the error function so let me go and call the function and i will simply save response over here and i will simply console.log that uh, response as well so yeah simply save it okay and now let me add semicolon over here save it okay now what i need to do i need to create a one post controller over post route over here so i will create the post route so i will call post and post and then i will say post controller colon colon class and i will call store method and i will also define the name of the route so i will say post dot store okay simply save it and now let me go to the controller and create another function for it and i will say store okay and what i will do i will simply return response and i will say json response and into that i will simply return all the parameter that we pass okay simply request all and simply save it okay and now let me go here into the blade file here i will be add the route name okay so simply go here and as a url i will say route and i will go post dot store simply save it okay and now let me run the project okay so let me go here and i will say php artisan sir okay yeah now let me go here and let me go to the post route yeah, you can see that there is a perfect simple form and let me make it a little bigger yeah and now let me open the console and i will say simply test and i will say test and submit you can see that i got the result you can see that test test because what we did simple what we pass that simply we return so what we will do over here so i will simply create the post using the post model so i will use the create create method and i will pass the title and simply i am getting from the request so i will say title and then i will say body and then i will say request body and simply save it okay and now what i pass i simply pass the post okay post over here and simply use the model over here app models and i will say post okay simply save it okay and now let me go here and hit refresh and let me click first and first body okay and simply clear it okay and now if hit submit you can see that created a body creation date and updation date and now if i go here into the database and hit browse you can see that first body and like uh, you can see that first record created now let me create another record like second and i will say second simply hit submit you can see that it created another so how easy the you can call the ajax request in laravel application so thank you so much guys and if you like this video then please subscribe my channel thank you so much for watching